What's up you guys, Keith Demel here. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna talk about three books that you absolutely need for your flight training. Stay tuned. Now these books that I mentioned are for flight training in Canada. The information that you will learn will help you pass your pilot written exams. I personally bought some of these books when I was 16 years old and I still have it till this day. Okay, so now let's look at the top three books that I recommend that you need for your flight training. The first book that I recommend you getting is called From the Ground Up. This book is over 70 years old and of course they've made the revisions over the years for updates. It has been said that every pilot who has trained in Canada has used this book. The first part is aircraft operations. In chapter one, you'll learn about different parts of the airplane chapter 2 the theory of flight chapter 3 about the engines part 2 of this book I would be a little cautious of as some of this information might be outdated by the time you get it so I would get the updated information directly from the Transport Canada website part 3 is a meteorology section it's a very small section so for more information on learning meteorology in Canada I would recommend another book which I'm going to talk about next part 4 is navigation and communications this is a very good section that you need to learn for your private pilot's license and and part five is the airmanship, human factors, and air safety section. The second book I recommend you getting is called Canadian Aviation Weather. It's by our friend Doug Morris, who is a meteorologist, but also a pilot for Air Canada with over 24,000 hours of flying. He currently flies the Boeing 787 Dreamliner. The good thing about this book is that it's written by a meteorologist and a pilot who's able to explain the type of weather that you will experience in Canada. When you go to the table of contents page, you'll see that it's over 30 different chapters that covers everything that you'll need to know about Canadian aviation weather. When you first start out, understanding weather can be a little confusing, but this book does a great job explaining everything in simple terms and makes it easy for you to understand as a student pilot. Another great thing about this meteorology textbook is that it's loaded with colorful pictures, which is a great thing considering that most of the meteorology textbooks out there are black and white and quite dry. So in this book, Canadian Aviation Weather, you learn a lot of important concepts such as fronts, jet streams, and how to read weather charts. All useful information considering that as a pilot, you're going to be encountering weather for the rest of your career. And the third book I recommend you buying is called the Flight Training Manual. So the Flight Training Manual teaches you exactly how to fly an airplane, such as taxiing, takeoff, landing, steep turns, etc. All you have to do as a student pilot is to review each exercise before you go flying and then practice it with your instructor so that it becomes that much easier when you try it in the airplane. The second part of the Flight Training Manual that's also important besides learning how to fly is the actual paperwork. There's a funny saying in aviation that you can only go flying if the paperwork equals the weight of the airplane. Meaning, unless you cross your T's and dot your I's, you can't actually safely take the airplane. So in the flight training manual, you'll also learn how to do a weighted balance to ensure that the airplane is balanced for flight. And you'll learn all the important documentation that's legally required to be on the airplane, such as the certificate of airworthiness and the certificate of registration. So in summary, go ahead and buy these three books. From the Ground Up, Canadian Aviation Weather, and the Flight Training Manual. Each one of these books really helps you through your flight training journey. It'll help you be a safe and competent pilot. So I thought I'd share three books that have helped me and my students in their flight training journey. If you like this type of videos, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you next time.